been questions circulating on social media regarding the lack of adherence to protocols at funerals, particularly in light of the numerous state and heroes burials conferred on dignitaries of late. Now to speak to us to explain some of the related issues is the Deputy Minister of Information and Communication Technology, that is Ms. Emma Theophilus. Deputy Minister, good evening and thank you so much for joining us. Sorry, Deputy Minister, can you hear us? Yes, I can hear you. Ah, thank you so much. Good evening and thank you for joining us. Well, yes. there's been displeasure aired around the close proximity that mourners were allowed to view the body at the funeral of the late liberation struggle veteran, Ngarukutuka uh, Chiriange. What is the misunderstanding that the government hoped to clear up around that specific event? Uh, thank you so much, uh, Theo. Uh, the misunderstanding is around um, the cause of death of, of, the, li of the late Dr. Chiriange. Mm -hmm. um, the report is that he passed on due to COVID-19, which is not factual. He did not pass on due to COVID-19, and this was made very clear at the memorial service by the Deputy Prime Minister, who then um, invited the procession to go and view the body, um, led by the chief mourner, represented by the vice president, um, and, and that led to the misunderstanding. But Dr. Chiriange did not pass on due to COVID-19, and therefore no regulations uh, were broken during that process. Now, we understand you are currently out on patrol with law enforcement. What has been your experience so far out there on the streets, and how are people adhering to the lockdown regulations? Yes, uh, Theo, we are here uh, in, in Vantuk patrolling with the Namibian Police Force, led by... Commissioner Basson, the Commerce Regional Commander. Um, a lot of the operations see that many people are not adhering to wearing of masks and maintaining social distancing. Uh, a lot of people are roaming the streets in large numbers and, and big crowds, um, but they're not adhering to the regulations. So that has been um, the concern so far. Well, Deputy Minister, thank you so much once again for making the time to join us, and please be safe out there on the streets.